diet. Oops. But I was only getting started. I always put the forks and knives in different drawers around the house after washing them and screwed up the TV remote so it wouldn't work properly. I dyed my hair orange and got fake piercings and tattoos, but told her they were real. She was so upset, she got me enrolled in an insanely strict school. They have uniforms and rules. I'm sure they'll knock some sense into you. Not if I knock them over first. St. Mary's was a mansion with super rich kids. The lawns were perfectly kept, and the halls were so clean they shone like diamonds. But I got in trouble on the very first day. I was putting my books in my locker when suddenly someone threw a hoodie in my face. Wear this. Your ugly face is gonna make me vomit. Then look somewhere else, creep. This is a respectable school. We don't want people like you, so you better clean up. She knocked the milkshake out of my hand and pushed me down in the mess. I saw red. I was about to get up and slap this crazy witch when suddenly a boy came running down the hall and stood between us. Picking on the new kid on the first day? You're really desperate for attention, aren't you, Crystal? Mind your own business, Anthony. This is my school, not your dad's office. What I say goes. Maybe I should give him a call and we'll see who really runs this school. Crystal looked furious. She flipped her hair and left with her minions and Anthony helped me up. Hey, I'm sorry about Crystal. Just because she's the principal's daughter, she thinks she can boss everyone around. Thanks for coming in like a knight in shining armor. I always wanted to save a damsel in distress. Oh, you didn't save me. You saved her from me. But the teachers at the school were like Mom Pro Max. They gave detention for everything. Need to sharpen your pencil twice a day? Detention. Spend more than five minutes in the bathroom? Detention. The last straw for me was when one of the teachers